Italy and I am about to detect this old vineyard. I have permission from the owner to search the grounds and I am pretty excited. Uh, the vineyard's been around for 1100 years and not too far from here uh, there was a battle site between the Romans and the Greeks. Alright, got my first target here. It's coming in about 63, 66. It's about five inches down, uh, right by this big tree here. So let's go ahead and see what it is. looks like it's a pendant of some kind I think it's um it looks like it's a little girl that's pretty interesting she's got the ponytails her arms are up like she's happy all right well first find at the vineyard I got a shallow 75 right here. Very shallow. It's a coin. It is 20 cents euro. Not old. Recent drop. Spend it on the train. Two thousand. All right. Let's see what else we get. All right. So the owner just came over and he brought me over to his villa, which is just across the driveway here. And this is the side view. But uh, they hold a lot of weddings and things here. But he said that this is all original. It hasn't changed much. Uh, and then there's this ancient column that was found on the property as well put back together but there is a lot of history over here um, including a uh, grave site down there uh, as well as the family dog <laughs> uh, that's Bobby anyway uh, he said give this whole area a look so we'll do that and I'm this neat little guy Piazzo Fazerio. Uh, I'm not sure if it's like um, just like a little label that maybe went around like a wine bottle or something. Um, it's got two little holes in it. Then, of course, the picture of the house with some columns next to it. Pretty cool. Let's clean it up. See what uh, see what we can get. I'm sure the owner, uh, Paolo. Alright, uh, right in the little front garden area here. Finally got my first older coin that's not a euro, but it's not old by European or Italian standards. But it is from 1957. Uh, it says 20 on it. I think these were called lira before they switched to euro. So, alright, we're getting there, 1957. Uh, let's see if we can get something in like the 16th. Alright, here it is, this morning's hunt. Uh, went all over the place. Got plenty of trash. Got plenty of other little what's-its and trinkets. Some buttons, keys, gear, some bullets. Did find a little kid's ring. Uh, got the little pendant here. That was my very first target of the day. It's kind of neat. Found a little butterfly uh, pendant as well. 
and a couple little hearts from part of the chain. Uh, we got some euro here. No clue how much. Maybe about seven euro. Got a couple two euros, ones, a lot of fifties, a lot of twenties, tens. It's probably about seven euro or so. Uh, got a phone token, and of course, uh, found out what this was. I asked uh, Paolo, and he said that it was a little medal that the uh, horses used to win uh, when they would show the horses. And this is one of the medals that. They had found, and then of course the 20 lira, 1957. So, all in all, not a bad hunt. Um, I was hoping for a little bit more as far as the old old goes, but hey, I can't complain. I'm in Italy. The food and the wine are delicious, and I think. I will go enjoy some of that right now. Alright everybody, keep your coil to the soil, and remember, swing for the ring.